just to keep it recording. All right. Hello, everyone. It's me, Loki, back with some more 13 Days of Halloween. Still here with D3. Yes, we finished the last uh, one like two seconds ago, so. We're yeah. Good. Why are you going to ruin the movie magic? Because <laughs> 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 they're not getting this video two seconds after it's uploading. <laughs> they have no well, idea. Well, they should. They should. Back to back. Back to back releases Amnesia on the same night. Yep. Do okay, it. you know what? Because you want it, we'll we'll make it that way. We're here trying to figure out what the hell to do. Uh, you said there you was... saw something walking up some stairs, man. I heard something definitely walking up these stairs, so I'm going to walk up these stairs. I seem to have been able to find some compound stuff. I don't know if I need to use it there now, but for now, I think I'm going to climb up here. I'm guessing Dude. you're going to have to use that. Make make like a chemical or something for that wall of like goo or whatever that was. Oh yeah, make like an explosion of some kind. I'm guessing, but like how? <laughs> yeah, that's a good question. This is like the 1980s. Like see. how are you are you doing that? Mad scientist much? Okay, evidence in the laboratory reveals combining chemicals creates a powerful acid. Yeah, see, that's what I thought. Oh, like okay, acid. so we need to go to the wine cellar. Okay. All right. And you're going to use that on the wall, which is why they sent you this way. That makes sense. That makes sense. Also, I don't have access to it's locked. You'll need to find you need to open it without a key. How do I open something without a key? No, it find... says you won't be able to get in without the key. Okay. We have to find the key. All right. Shout out to Champagne Enema, who's just played a game. So that <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that name's going to show up on the video, but he showed up for me. <laughs> Right, let's I don't know see. where you'll find a key at. Yeah. Hmm. I need to also figure out how to get my lantern back working, because I don't have much protection against the dark. Uh, the lantern seems to be my only form of doing it, and I don't have a way of doing it at the moment. Your lantern doesn't work anymore? No, I have to, I have oils for it, but I need to go to a special place and put oils the oils back inside of it, basically. Uh, so oh, right now, I see. Yeah, my... Like a refill? Yeah, like a refill station or something. Did we come from here? No, right? Fragment taste of Dropping kind of a couple frames right now. <laughs> if I have no idea where we are, you have no idea where I am. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm, I'm not reliable at all, if you don't know. <laughs> okay. I don't know if you heard that, but there was definitely a growling monster somewhere in here. I did not. All right. What? Okay, no, it's just this right. Is that a rat? Hello, no, rat friend. Like yeah, leave him alone. Let him hide I mean, in this corner. <laughs> I'm gonna let him be well, him. He can hide. Nice. The unflinching African sun has not to be com the African sun, not to be confused with the regular sun. <laughs> <That is, laughs> it was a different time, 1983. They thought for some reason. <laughs> they thought for some reason the African sun was much harder and different. He told me about the legend of Tin Hanar. There's tombs? The all. Oh, I guess, yeah. I keep forgetting sure, that um, so right. Egypt's in Africa, so there would actually be tombs and shit in Africa. That evening, yes, crazy. Yeah, I had no idea. To a sand um, stone I blame history not teaching me correctly, or the Bible. Combine one of those two things that just did not teach me uh, where Egypt was. lead the men into the ancient structure. Hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter okay. what the professor is keeping from me, the dig So I think this is me talking to myself. And, the British Museum. and I think we're still talking about killing a man. What kind of man? Hard to know. Oh, there's a picture of the white people I was talking about. Perfectly calm. Which is like half of what all old art is to me. <laughs> is very nice pictures oh, of people. people. Yeah, a white people enjoying a picnic usually. Oh my god. Later. <laughs> oh, it didn't land perfectly. Not a haunted chair. Not a haunted chair. We're actually testing these to see if they're haunted. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> this further proves that the other chair was haunted. Yeah, exactly. This guy, I think, if you know, if he was in a different time, he could definitely be a basketball player. By the way, he's chucking them chairs with <laughs> such panache mm -hmm. yeah. and force. Wow. That won't. Okay, that's that a haunted guy. chair. The way it landed right yeah, now, I don't approve of. Yeah, later. There's also seeming some weird gases around me. 
So that means that there's nothing good to be found here. Really wish I could find a way to get that lens sturdy. It said study. <laughs> I just added the R. Okay, let's... Okay, we all make mistakes, Bogey. It's true, here. but... You know, How this is my... Fire? Oh, I had a... I, I accidentally right. fucked up and used one of my light and my matchstick oh, boxes <laughs> for this room that oh. has no puzzle in it. <laughs> so I, I feel like I've just wasted uh, that. Um... Alright. Let's see. I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient. That's two out of three. Of Apparently, there's one more. Yeah. Burned faintly in the murky air as we I think every story that starts with "I took some men into a dark, ancient passage" is automatically just not good. In any, <laughs> in any case, anytime you have to get a bunch of men to say, "We need to go down this dark, ancient passage," I'm kind of like not, I'm not joining you. I'm not, I'm not down with this plan of yours. Yeah, I, I can't say that I'd be down either. Confused me. No, I don't. I'm pretty sure I'm not partaking in that. You know, no. but that that could just be me though. I don't know. Yeah, built different from all those other horror movie dudes. I'm not yeah. going. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not, I'm not going to a cabin in the woods. You guys have fun. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going wow, well, anywhere. You're such a scaridy cab, man. Don't even want to go to a freaking cabin, bro. Dude, cabins are scary. Have you been to a cabin? No. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I'm not going to no fucking cabin. I don't know what's out there. I don't think so. Maybe when I was a kid, but obviously I don't remember. So no. Yeah. I don't think I would either, though. Like even if I owned one, like I don't think I would go. No kind of way. Weird. Yeah, it is weird because you're just out there. You could be attacked by wolves. You could be attacked yeah, by a, zom a zombie. That zombie like or, or whatever. Yeah. Probably yeah. Not for me. A Sasquatch. I'm sure monster. some of the viewers have have uh, cabins. Let us if, know your your how opinions it goes for on you guys. Yeah, if you have a cabin and that you regularly go to with no fear, please tell me how you live your life because I don't understand. Yeah, because yeah, well, I don't think I could, man. What the fuck? Haunted jar. <laughs> haunted jar I tossed it and it just automatically crumbled in my hand old tomes that sounds good it's just Not... really old man it's a really old jar oh fuck oh shit I see that yeah that's he's getting uh, high again he's getting high off the fumes of something again more oil but no oh I got a tinderbox that's good the only thing I... you ever find is the same stuff oil and tinderboxes yeah, that seems to be the only thing that ha they have in this house at all. Okay, I'm going to put a light here just to stop my guy from freaking the hell out for a bit. All right. So he was seriously just getting a little bit too high for my tastes. It's pretty funny how that happens, though. He starts completely freaking out. Yeah. <laughs> like how they called it like his sanity earlier. Like that's that's pretty accurate assessment. Completely yeah. loses all sanity. I mean, this guy, based off of the way I'm playing him, he seems like a crazy person, the way he's picking up these chairs to check if they're haunted. Oh, and just, yeah, completely throwing them across the room, picking yeah. up freaking haunted jars. What's going on here? Yeah, smashing haunted jars. Um, move, move. I don't like the way this moves either. It's a haunted dressing room. Haunted dressing door. Now, if I was a horror person, I would put a jump scare inside one of these. Nothing, though. We haven't had anything like that in the game yet. No. Which makes me feel like they're really building up towards something. Which I don't appreciate them doing. I would appreciate it if they just actually... <laughs> what? Haunted piano. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that. Nope. We're leaving. I'm trying to leave. I'm going to open up this piano. I was actually kind of hoping it would let me play the piano, but I can't play the piano. Could you imagine? It plays, you know, random tunes. Yeah. Your inputs. Is that a woman with a skull on her face holding a baby? This painting's skull moving. Woman, yeah. yeah, I see it. All right. Your, your guy's just getting freaked out looking at it. That's what it is. Hold up. <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> it refuses to get hit. He just, like, literally... There we go. Fucking haunted painting. Bet this one's haunted, too. Let's look. Well, I heard that, but I'm going to ignore it. There was definitely something here. Let me see if this is a haunted picture, too. Yeah, this one's moving, too. But this is just There's a guy on a faces. horse. They are all skull faces. I didn't even notice oh, that. Oh, hell no. Nope. I'm gone. Nope. Later. All right. 
going into the dark, spooky room seems like the right move. Without your lantern? Dude, I wish I could use this goddamn lantern. <laughs> another rat. There is another rat. Oh, there's some more oil. Is there not, like a setting you can do to manually use the oil? You know what? That's a good question. Nope, I have options and return to game. Pretty bad. I think they they told me how to light the lantern. I just have to find the light the lantern station basically. Uh. Okay. Perfectly here. We just need to find the key. Then we can get the hell out of here. And of uh, course, he's gonna have a drug trip while we're here. I, I saw writing. I think pop in on those papers. Oh yeah. I can't read any of it because it's in handwriting. I mean cursive. Yeah. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. This. The ground will tremble Ooh, and I bet I could find a tinderbox in here. On us, Damn it, oil. Downstairs. Oh, and tinderbox. Here, that works for here, me. Literally the only th the only two the things you'll ever find. On it. Yeah, no, it's true. I'd rather find that than ghost, I guess. Yeah, it's better than uh, than getting a jump scare. It's better than being haunted by um, haunted pianos and these fucking skull pictures of <laughs> that seem to be everywhere. It's like almost like the wall move. Yeah, the can't break that by hand. Not breakable by hand. Maybe something. It sounded like Throw something, something got at it. Throw one of those oh. chairs at that wall. I like your thought. All right, <laughs> come here, chair. Are you right. able to pick up rocks? You know what? That's a good thing to check. I will check after this. Wow, it worked. Oh yeah, I see. Good the job, chair. <laughs> the game has little things like that you might have to consider doing from time to time, I guess. Man. I really didn't think that was going to work, by the way. <laughs> if, if, it were, if it were not for you, I would have been stuck on that puzzle for a while. You'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? This is one of those scooby doo things. What? Okay. Yeah, this is a scooby doo book. You know, you know those books where when you pull them, um, a secret passage opens up? Oh, yeah. I think that's what that is. So let me quickly turn on the lights and see. This is three of three. Right? Oh, no, I have to break it open. Let me get my handy chair. See if I can break the glass with this chair. That's hilarious. It'd be funny if this worked. <laughs> of course it, it worked. It did. It totally worked. Uh, another region rich with lore is Alstit, deep within the East Russian woods. For centuries, there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbors... Castle Brenberg, the quiet forest clad mountains dressed with a scattering lakes, it's picturesque as can be, albeit in areas haunted by the dark. See, this is what we're talking about haunted cabin in the woods. This Asking one actually isn't even uh, three out of three either. No, it isn't. Like it's a just. One. Man, the, there's an immortal baron? Oh, I guess it's just like local folklore about what's going on in here, maybe? Well, yeah, sounds kind of random. It is. Let me free this book real quick. Goddamn chair. This chair is honestly OP. Yeah! Oh, there's a way to go in here. Nope, never mind, it's locked. Oh, that's right, we're looking for a key. Yeah, we are looking for a key of some kind. I have to assume it's in here. I'm hearing something related to a mechanism when I pull these. Or maybe I'm just going crazy. I hear I'm like a rattle. Yeah, I'm definitely hearing a rattle. But what the rattle means, the world may never know. But the world wants to know. Hmm. Let me try pulling again. Maybe that's the opening to the door? No. Alright, let's try looking. Go, oh, pick up this oil. That one, one day says locked, though. It doesn't say that there's a key. No, it just says straight up locked, which makes me feel like I probably can't do anything. Map room. How'd these rocks get in here? I don't know. Seems impossible for them to actually enter it. Central Prussia. What is going on? I hit my head oh. on something. There it is. That might be 3 or 3. Yeah. Yeah, this is it. 
This is three or three. My guy's getting his drink on once again. Falling to the floor. Seventeenth May. Having a good time. Yeah. He's get he that's such a good drunk, he's marking it down in his diary, like May 1839. <laughs> this is when the good stuff hit. This was a good day. I fell to the ground. Grasping for air. Go to the light. I can walk towards the light. But I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away. Unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. Oh, I know what this the is. This is Cthulian stuff. Is the That's not good. Sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Hmm. All right. Let me just check real quick and see if there's anything in here. Nope, just a book. Anything in here? So anything? still no key, huh? Yeah, no key. Tinderbox, though. We have to find that key eventually. We're gonna run out of room before <laughs> before we find this damn key. We're never gonna find this stupid key. No, we're in the wine cellar where we're supposed to. No, that's right. We need the key to the wine cellar. Yeah. But I'm also going to be real. I don't know how the hell we're going to get out of here cuz you know the <laughs> our pathway was destroyed by rocks. Oh, so, is that what the the boulders falling was? Yeah, it totally was. So we we probably need to go through that locked door. Yeah, we need to find a way to get through the locked door. Um I think it has to be related to the books of pulling the books. So I'm going to go back in there now that I've touched some dark stuff. Maybe now the door will open for me. Oh shit, what? This is bullshit. I now now the lantern wants to work for me for some reason. All right, let me see. I need to find a book that can be pulled apart like the other two could. Yeah. Let me see. Nothing. Nope. Okay. Nope, this is just a regular old book. Another regular old book. There it is. So. Yes. Then pull this. Maybe pull oh, the yeah, other those one? those ones are kind of like glowing a little bit. Yeah. It seems there has to be something with them. It won't open. Are you sure you pulled them out enough? I think I did. All of them? Can't really do much more than you already did for that one. God damn it! My lantern's gone again. <laughs> well, it still kind of glows a little bit, like that one right there. Yeah, the I think there's is, only three. The rule of three would just suggest that there are just three here. But but I don't uh, hear the little ticking when you pull that first book. No, because it already happened when I pulled it first. Uh. Here's the third one. Let me see if I can turn on the lights a little bit, see if that helps. Ooh, maybe move these boxes. What did you do with that other book? I wonder why it was under glass. Yeah, I don't know what happened to that book. That book is gone now, though, because I, <laughs> I tossed it aside very long ago. So now it just kind of yeah. looks like every other book. I feel oh, like weird. those three had to... Oh, wait. Is there something here? Yeah, there is. Yeah. There has to be. Yeah, this is the way through. No so, wonder. Yeah, okay, so. Let me see. I feel like it had to do with. Put, there you go, there's one. I feel like I'm grabbing it, but it's not registering. Okay, maybe the other one. Maybe there's a specific order I need to do them in? 
I don't know. Oh wait, there it is. It, it I totally pulled it out just now. So I need to pull this one. Come on. Come on, book. Work with me, book. There we go. Yeah, all three of them, same time. Yeah, that, that's all three of them. That should work. Can you not right. push this or pull this? I feel like I pushed and pulled all three of them out right... What? Okay. <laughs> it works now. <laughs> that was random. It just decided to work. Yeah, at least it feels like that to me. So if it felt like that to me... Here. There it is. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> and the music spikes. Spooky chair. No, okay. Chair's cool. So now we have Look to get the wine cellar key is like behind some random ass door. Oh hey, the the face is gone. What the hell? Yeah, they're back. But the different normal. paint. It's a painting, but like they're not they're not the weird versions. Yeah, you're right. These are the what same the paintings that were in that room. They're all fixed. But they're now. not they're not the freaking uh, skull ver face versions. No. Like the chick with the, the the baby on that one on the far right. Yeah, yeah, they're all perfectly fine now. Yeah. This also, that's this lady also looks like she's selling a bunch of babies. At least that's <laughs> I don't know what's going on oh, in this yeah, picture. Oh yeah, kind of does. And this old man seems uh, either very interested in the wares or is here to cuss her out. I don't know which one. It can kind of go either way in these olden time <laughs> pictures. Yeah. So I assume that our way opened up again, unless we can make it through that locked door right here. Let's find out. Because our way was. Still oh shit! Up. The door just opened. Yeah, see, it had. To, we have to go this way. All right, hold we up. We have no choice. We have no choice. We will continue going through this door in the next one because this one also hit the twenty-minute mark of us trying to figure out what's going on. So join us for another installment of more amnesia as the thirteen nights continue, and we figure out what's going on with all these damn haunted chairs and haunted paintings. Yeah, it's freaky stuff, man.